A reading from the book of the prophet Ezekiel. The word of the Lord came to me. So you, mortal, I have made a sentinel for the house of Israel. Whenever you hear a word from my mouth, you shall give them warning from me. If I say to the wicked, O wicked ones, you shall surely die, and you do not speak to warn the wicked to turn from their ways, the wicked shall die in their iniquity, but their blood I will require at your hand. But if you warn the wicked to turn from their ways, and they do not turn from their ways, the wicked shall die in their iniquity, but you will have saved your life. Now you, mortal, say to the house of Israel, Thus you have said, Our transgressions and our sins weigh upon us, and we waste away because of them. How then can we live? Say to them, As I live, says the Lord God, I have no pleasure in the death of the wicked, but that the wicked turn from their ways and live. Turn back. Turn back from your evil ways. For why will you die, O house of Israel? This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Responsorial Psalm 119 and the response. My delight shall be in your commandments. My delight shall be in your commandments. Teach me, O Lord, the way of your statutes, and I shall keep it to the end. Give me understanding, and I shall keep your law. I shall keep it with my whole heart. My delight shall be in your commandments. Lead me in the path of your commandments, for therein is my delight. Incline my heart to your testimonies, and not to unjust gain. Turn away my eyes, lest they gaze on vanities. Oh, give me life in your ways. My delight shall be in your commandments. Confirm to your servant your promise, which stands for all who fear you. Turn away the reproach which I dread, because your judgments are good. Behold, I long for your commandments. In your righteousness give me life. My delight shall be in your commandments. A reading from the letter of Paul to the Romans. Owe no one anything except to love one another. For the one who loves another has fulfilled the law. The commandments, you shall not commit adultery, you shall not murder, you shall not steal, you shall not covet, and then the other commandment are summed up in this word, love your neighbor as yourself. Love does no wrong to a neighbor. Therefore, love is a fulfilling of the law. Besides this, you know what time it is, how it is now the moment for you to wake from sleep. For salvation is nearer to us now than when we became believers. The night is far gone, the day is near. Let us then lay aside the works of darkness and put on the armor of light. Let us live honorably as in the day, not in reveling and drunkenness, not in debauchery and licentiousness, not in quarreling and jealousy. Instead, put on the Lord Jesus Christ and make no provision for the flesh to gratify its desires. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God.